If you are looking to buy or sell a home, get ready for quite a roller coaster ride. Yeah, indeed, the housing market in Kansas City is still white hot. KCTV 5's Nathan Vickers shows us what some buyers and sellers are going through. A new house represents a dream. Congrats, buddy. Thanks, man. We're excited. For Ryan Jones, his wife Quinn, and their kids, it's the dream of a big backyard, a little more space for a growing family. We're just looking to get um, a little more room, um, you know, a little bit more square footage. We love the location. We love the neighborhood. We met them on a walkthrough of their new home. At their old place, they're packing. Like most real estate transactions these days, both sales happened quickly. We listed on Tuesday and had 20 showings the first day, and I think 10 or 12 the second day, and we had determined by the end of the second day, we had had enough offers on the plate that we were ready to make a decision. It's a seller's market in the real estate world. It's crazy, it's exciting, it keeps me on my toes. Blake Nelson is the Jones family's realtor. For the last few years, he's seen the local market heating up. According to the National Association of Realtors, homes in the Midwest have shot up in price 18% since last summer. With the market the way it is, the transactions are going so fast that, you know, I often tell my clients, let's sit down, let's discuss, let's have an educational meeting that may take an hour, may take two hours, and then we put on our seatbelts. It's driven in part by low interest loans and a small inventory of houses. Nelson showed us the number of active listings available in the metro. 3,500 houses, so that's staggeringly low. That's part of why the Joneses sold. The housing market really pushed us over the edge to make the commitment, let's start looking around. Some owners might look at the market and see an opportunity at the door. But even selling a home at a premium brings new challenges as a buyer or renter. The pros you get when selling a house are the cons you face buying a house. That's when they saw the flip side. We faced multiple times where we fell in love with houses, put in our best offer, and just flat out didn't win. That can feel a little bit frustrating, you know, especially when you walk into a house and you think this is the one. Representing a seller, it's fantastic, it's exciting because there's a lot of traffic and a lot of energy that occurs when a house goes on the market. But in representing a buyer, it can be frustrating because you kind of have to jump at a moment's notice when a house does come on the market. Despite the turmoil, the number of sales has also increased nearly 20% from last summer, though some realtors believe it'll peak soon if it hasn't already. I just think that the volatility will kind of subside and we will kind of slow down a bit, if you will. It can still seem daunting, which is why Nelson and his clients have this advice. The biggest piece of advice for someone buying or selling is to be prepared. Um, be educated. I think having a, a good realtor is, is really a benefit. It's an exciting time to be living in Kansas City. The housing market's hot. Even in a hot market, the Jones found their new home. And they're here to stay. It'll soon be a home. In Shawnee, Nathan Vickers, KCTV 5 News.